across the country. And every hour, we will have to complete some challenges that could possibly get us kicked out. The challenges will get progressively harder and harder throughout the video, starting with easy and going to extreme. That's even if you make it there, DJ Fab. Buddy, across the country and you're still talking smack? All right, all right, all right, boys. Calm down, okay? Are y'all ready for this? Born ready. Enter the Walmart in three, two, one. Let the games begin. Let the games begin. They're not ready, bro. You gotta do everything by yourselves. They're used to doing everything together. Who's gonna thrive under the big lights when the pressure's on? Your boy. I'm not gonna lie, normally when we go into Walmarts, we're all together with all of the boys, but we're going in solo today, so it's gonna make things a lot tougher, a lot more uncomfortable. I just hope those boys are ready for the challenges. This is what I was born for. Has to leave Walmart. $10,000, that money's coming home with me. We're just gonna go ahead and blend in like a casual shopper. These challenges, easy work. Oh my goodness, they're denying my access. Well, I was going through the exit sign. First thing you gotta do when you get up in a Walmart to not look suspicious is to get a cart and fill it with some things. So it looks like you're shopping even though you're not. I bet when these boys went in there, they didn't do any of that. They were probably so scared. They went to the bathroom. Nick's probably already peeing his pants, bro. The first thing I'm doing is go into the back of the store to avoid all of the workers. Because I'm gonna be in here for hours and hours. I don't want the workers to be seeing me all throughout the day wondering, yo, why is that kid still in here? I came to the back, to the camping section, and look what we have here, my friends. A nice chair already set up for your boy. A perfect spot to sit and chill in between the challenges. If an employee walks by, I'm just testing out the chair before I buy it. You know, I gotta make sure it's comfortable. Now that I'm in here, I got my spot. I'm gonna call the boys and see if they've made it in safely. You guys make it in okay? Did we make it in okay? Bro, I'm worried about you. Why would you be worried about me? I got a nice setup right now. I'm chilling in here, bro. There's so many employees over here, bro. I, I'm in the danger zone. Yeah, take out, bro. We, we know you're losing first. We know you're losing first. But boys, I think it is now time for the first challenge. Good luck. It is time for challenge number one. And from here on out, on the hour, every single hour we survive, we have to do a challenge. And if at any point we fail the challenge or don't complete it before the next hour, then we lose and we have to tell the other ones that we are officially out of the game. Last one to survive wins the $10,000. The first challenge, get someone to call you by the name on the back of this card. IMAP Use. How am I supposed to get someone to call me IMAP Use. IMAP Use. Get someone to call you by the name on this card. Thicky Ricky. I have to get someone to call me Thicky Ricky. And I can't tell them to just say my name. Get someone to call you by the name on this card. Toots McGiggles? Bro, no one's calling me that. What the? All right, we gotta rock because we only have an hour before the next challenge comes and I can't be jeopardizing this. We gotta make this happen. My strategy for getting someone to call me by IMAP Use is to simply have a normal conversation and at the end, I'm gonna ask what their name was and then I'm gonna tell them mine and hopefully they just say, oh, well, it was nice to meet you, IMAP Use. Let's hope this works. Excuse me? Do you think black blinds or white blinds would look better in like a gray room. What it, color's the frame? It looks like this. It's a white frame like that. Black would stand out. Thank you. What was your name? Becky. Becky? Nice to meet you. I'm Ap Use. Ap Use. I'm Ap Use. I'm Ap Use. That's me. Okay. Yes, it was <laughs> nice to meet you, Becky. Nice to meet you. Thank you so much. <laughs> Thank you for being so dumb. Boom! First challenge complete. Ooh, that was too easy. Literally the first person I went up to. My plan worked like a charm. Welcome back to the show. My name is your host, Vicky Ricky. Would you like to play? No, I don't think so. Thank you anyway. Okay, that's all right. Welcome back to the game show. Sticky Tricky with your host, Vicky Ricky. Are you ready to play? I don't know what you're talking about. Oh, it's the game Sticky Tricky with your host, Sticky Ricky. I'm the best host, right? I just met you. What's your name? 
Daisy. And I'm Sicky Ricky. Oh no, no, close. Oh. What's your name? You remember? Oh, you're Sicky Ricky. Oh, <laughs> yes. Nice to meet you. First one checked off the book, made it to the next round. Now I gotta survive for an hour in here without getting kicked out. Appreciate you. One more time for the people. Sicky Ricky. Yes. <laughs> Yes! Hey guys, sorry to bother you. Could you guys help me introduce my YouTube channel? All right, so just say subscribe to Toots McGiggles. Subscribe to... Toots? Toots? McGiggles. McGiggles. Subscribe to... Toots McGiggles. There we go. Yeah. Toots McGiggles. Done. Challenge one completed! So now I gotta lay low for the next challenge because we have one hour. I finished my first challenge with so much time to spare. I think I'm gonna go up to the front, buy myself a little snack, and then go chill in my chair for the next hour while I wait for the next challenge. That was just too easy. Got my snack right here. I'm in my seat, no employees to be found. It's gonna be a long day for you, boy. You guys are hungry? You said you wanted a piece? Don't worry. I got you guys. I know Ricky and DJ Fab probably aren't feeding you, but I got you. Here. Here you go. Psych! Come on now. I need to eat this to stay fueled up to win the challenge. I can't be giving my food to y'all. I got about an hour until the next challenge. Don't know what the other boys are doing. I'm gonna try and get a little bit of rest. I'm gonna make a toilet paper fort just for fun, just so I can chill in it, not have to worry about walking around and the employees seeing me too much. Just like that, a fort is completed. Your boy can rest up in here, and hopefully no one tells on me, but uh, I'm just gonna go in. Oh, man. And now, I just rest. It's honestly key that I'm in here, because there's no chance of the employees seeing me over and over and over again. The more I can reduce that, the more chance I have of not getting kicked out and actually winning this competition. There's no way the other boys are living like this. Is there any way you can hold my camera while I show you my piano skills? What would you rate that, one through 10? Uh, five. A five? five. It has been another hour, so now it is time to pull the next challenge. Got it right here, folks. Sneak something into someone's cart. This is light work. This is light work. We stuck pumpkins. We stuck Christmas trees into people's carts in the past. This is going to be a tough one. Normally, when we're doing sneaking stuff into people's carts videos, we have a filmer and then we can just move around freely. But we're going to have to film ourselves while doing this, while not getting caught. This is going to be tough. It should be easy. I got the item. I'm going to be sneaking into someone's cart. A pair of baby shoes. Kind of fire. Go time. Oh, she has no idea. She has no idea. You have no idea, right? No. No idea. Fist bump for IMAP Usa. What? Fist bump for IMAP Usa. Going right here, guys. The item that you pick is crucial. I'm going with Lucky Charms because it is gonna take a little bit of luck in order to pull this off. But honestly, I think I got it. Here we go, boys. Which one would you say is the better cereal? Would you say that one? My friends always told me to get this one. Thank you so much. Appreciate the help. Let's go. Got it done. Easy work. She had no idea, bro. Just completed my second challenge, and my boy came up to me. What's your name, bro? Jamie. I don't know what the other boys are doing. They're probably trying to buy a bunch of stuff, do a bunch of random stuff. The less you're seen, the less you do, the higher chance of survival. So I'm just gonna go back to my fort and wait another hour until the next challenge comes around. I don't think I'm gonna be kicked out of my fort, because normally when we're doing those forts, we're doing a bunch of crazy stuff. But right now, I'm just chilling back there, keeping low, staying quiet, and taking this dub. Time to re-enter my fort, stay low for the next hour. All right, the plan here is to find a busy aisle, just like this right here. Bro, oh, I'm folding right now so bad. Do you know if Skittles are better than Starburst? With the less sugar. That's what I go with. How, how can you tell? Well, thank you so much. Oh my God. Yo, is there anything you want to tell you, Nation? 
up, guys? Too many, yo, it's too many people going on right now. Yo, no, this is insane. I'm getting yo. kicked. I'm getting kicked out. Yo, Gideon. I'm getting kicked out. The boys still haven't called, which means we're all still in this challenge. Have someone correctly guess your accent? French. Huh? <sighs> we. <laughs> huh? We oui, we. Oui. I'm trying to sound like <laughs> British. Russian? How am I gonna do a Russian accent? So I gotta go up to someone and have them guess that I'm doing a British accent. It shouldn't be too hard, mate. Oh, that. <laughs> Crumpets and tea. Oh, bip bip cheerio, mate. Oh, from across the pond. I got this. Hey, how you doing, mate? Lovely day. Lovely day, ain't it, right, mate? Oh, oh. Just talking to all my chaps back home from okay. across the pond. Where are you from? Where do you think I'm from? England. England? Yes, mate. That's exactly where. My name's Imap Use. Can you say that? My name is Imap Use. Imap Use. Imap Use. Oh, okay. Imap Use. Oh, yes. Nice to meet you, mate. Have I can't wait to show him back home. You know what I mean, mate? That was too easy. He literally asked me, where are you from? I said, take a guess, and he said, England. England, Britain, same thing. I'm counting that as a ding. Returning back to my setup after accomplishing the third round so far, no problems. I haven't even had a single run-in with an employee. I think I'm gonna go up to an employee, do the French accent, and see if they can guess. Just to let the other guys know that I'm about that action. They're trying to hide from the employees. I'm going straight for them. Oh, ah, oui, oui, oui. Ah, mon chéri. Huh? Ah, oui, oui. Mon no. chéri. Where would you say I'm from if we were to guess? Hong Kong. Hong Kong. Bro, <laughs> what the hell? Oh my gosh. Ah, mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Huh? Ah, ah, oui, oui, mon chéri. Oh, bonjour. Hi, hi, hi. Oh, hi, ratatouille. What? Oh, 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 oh. What did you ah, say? Say it in English. I'm speaking in accent. No, what accent not. am I from? Where are you from? Uh, that's for you to guess. Well, you're speaking in French, but you look Chinese. Oh, my, bro. I can't catch a break here, bro. Hong Kong. I can't catch a break, brother. I'm taking L. Rope handle, tubes, storage bins, organizer, storage containers. That was a Britain accent. Uncle, I'm from Can you guess where my accent's from? Sounds European. You can take a wild guess. German? We go from the war, sir. War, sir? Well, it sounds like uh, England or Ireland. Thank you so much. Okay, good luck. They don't understand. They don't understand. Can you guess where I'm at? Where do you think I'm from? Australia. Uh, close. We go to war all the time. Russia? We're from Russia. Russia. <laughs> yes, yes. We're from Russia. We're from Russia. Bonjour! Bonjour! No, thank you. <laughs> alright, alright. Ho ho ho! Ah, oui, oui, mon chéri! <laughs> if you were to guess where I'm from, where would you say? Winter Haven. What? Winter Haven. Where's that? Oh, if you were to guess where I'm from, where would you say? Michael. Alright. Bonjour, mon chéri! Hi. Where am I from? Um, Italy. Italy? French. Bonjour? Uh. Bonjour? Excuse me, madame. Bonjour, I'm Bonjour. Oh, hi. Where would you say I'm from? I don't know. If you were to guess. Let me see. Jose. Any guesses? Venezuela. Venezuela? I have been doing this for the past 40 minutes. I only got 20 more minutes to figure this out. Time is running out, boys. I feel like I'm doing a good job. I don't know what's wrong with me, man. Everyone just saying I'm from all these countries like China or... Hong Kong. Well, you're speaking in French, but you look Chinese. Venezuela. Venezuela? Come on, I'm literally saying bonjour. I'm sealing the deal right now. Time is running out. If I don't secure it right now, I'm not making it to the next round, and I'm gonna be the first one to lose. And I can't have that happen. Can't lose to DJ Fab. NCK, that's fine, but DJ Fab, no. Oui, oui, mon chéri. Huh? Ah, oui, oui, bonjour, mon chéri. <laughs> oh, madame. How are you doing today? I'm good, thank you. If you were to guess where I'm from, where would you say? Oui, oui. Sounds like Paris. But where is Paris located? France. Paris, France. Let's go! Oh, oui, oui. <laughs> Can you say oh, oui, oui? With minutes to spare, I'm talking to you. I was on my 50th minute. I was game seven. I was G7 up in there, as Fousey would say. And I secured it barely with enough time to make it before the next challenge. But I did it, boys. Another hour, 
another challenge, and this challenge says ride a bicycle to the milk aisle and back. Where's our bike aisle? This is definitely the hardest challenge yet. This one's gonna be tough, but I think I can pull it off. You think I can do it, sir? Yeah. You believe in me? Yep. You think I'm gonna win? Yeah, I hope you do. Let's go, man. <laughs> The way this Walmart is set up is the bikes are right over there, but the milk aisle is all the way on the opposite side of the store, which means I have to drive this bike across the entire store and back without getting kicked out by an employee. Here is the bike section, and step number one to completing this challenge is finding what bike your boy is gonna take. I gotta take something fast. Can't be taking this one. This one is just gonna draw way too much attention. All right, we got options right here. I'm going with this bike right here. I mean, just look at it. It looks insanely fast. It's already out. Putting the kickstand up and uh, I guess I'm just gonna go for it. Here is all the bikes and I can't make this up. It is on the complete opposite side of this entire Walmart. So I'm gonna have to go from this side all the way to the other side, touch the milk and make it back without getting caught. And you know, I was taking a look at some of these bikes, but this one right here caught my eye. I mean, buddy, this thing looks fast. It's got the training wheels, so I can still be able to film. We're going straight for the main aisle. I don't even care. All right, guys, we got our bike here. We gotta get to the milk section. Oh my, the seats are all messed up. I don't know how this is gonna work, bro. In and out, to the milk and back, baby. I'm zooming right now. I'm zooming, I'm zooming, I'm zooming, I'm zooming. There's a bunch of workers right here. Hopefully I don't get caught. Buddy right there, didn't say anything. All right guys, so far, so good. A couple employees have seen me, but no one said anything. So, as long as I don't get kicked out. Oh my goodness, oh my goodness. Excuse me, don't mind me. Excuse me guys, sorry. Oh my bro, the milk is across the nation. Oh, we're going fast, bro. So far, no employees have said anything. That was an employee right there. But you know what this is right here, baby? the milk boom now i gotta go all the way back we're back on the road we're back on that main aisle in and out baby just gotta make it back to the bike aisle and we're good almost there zoom in past people what's up man what happened i got a test drive sorry but uh, i got a test drive stop i promise you i'm not trying to be okay i'll walk it back i'll walk it back no no i'm actually gonna buy it i'm actually gonna buy it you can't ride it it's called a walmart police that's fine. I had no idea. I didn't know you could she not touch She just said she'll beat me up. They can't hold me back, right? I'm coming through with the dub. Let's go. She's taking a picture of me. Cops are getting called, I think, boys. Come on, remember, we gotta make it there and back. I found the milk. There it is. We made it. Keep going, man. Thank you, don't sir. Crash. I won't crash. We touched that 2% milk, baby. There's no losing here, baby. You don't need to be riding the bike and video and inside the store. I'm not. You, um, no, you are because I've watched you go this way and now you're coming back this way. Am I getting Get kicked off out? the bike. You will. Are you management? I am not management. But you're not management? I'll go get them. No. Almost there, almost there. Just past an employee. They don't even care, though. Here's the bike aisle. Here we go, baby. Oh, cruising in. And boom, fourth round challenge completed. Come on, son, stop playing with me. I could do a whole lap around this Walmart, but I'm not going to. There are still more challenges awaiting, progressively getting harder. That was a pretty tough one, so I don't know what's gonna be coming next, but I don't know if Ricky and DJ Fab are gonna make it past this bike one. All right, we're at the milk. I'm at least completing this challenge, even if they call the cops. You think you could open that for me? I gotta touch the milk and then ride all the way back. Do what? I just gotta touch the milk. Thank you, sir. Yeah. Boom, 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 boom. Appreciate it, man, you helped me so much. <laughs> Boys, I'm definitely getting caught up in here. Trying to go fast, but this bike is too tiny for me. Rick Ireland over Yes, sir. There. I'm taking the dub right now. All right, here we go. Gotta park the bike. They're on to me, boys. I might be banned from all Walmarts after this, but who knows. Park the bike. Challenge complete. Let's go. Not sure if they're calling the cops on me or not. I think they are, but what can I do? I gotta complete this challenge. Yo, met the boys out here. Who's taking it out today? DJ Vlad. We gotta go. We gotta go ASAP. I gotta complete the challenge at least. I'm still Gucci. I'm still alive. He says you're gonna get management, but I'm gonna go hide. Bro. What are y'all talking about? I'm gone. Come on, I gotta find a spot. Can I go in here? Oh my goodness. Bro, I'm getting booted. I don't mind. It's, it's over. It's over. It's, the police? No, they're waiting for me at the front door, bro. First the lady told me, and then the guy in the black shirt came up and was like, bro, you gotta leave. $10,000 down the drain. 
No. I'm not sure what happened, but DJ Fabuloso was calling right now. I'm getting a call from Ricky and DJ Fab right now. Yo. It does not look like DJ Fab is in a Walmart. Bro, I just got kicked. I tried to run away and hide in a toilet paper fort, bro. And he got on the walkie talkie and it just didn't sound good. You hate to see it, buddy. Bud. Take a L, bro. We everyone knew you were losing first too, bro. Just give me a dollar when you whoever wins. I'll give you. I'll give you a dollar when I win. I got you. You ain't winning, buddy. All right, Rex. It's just down to me and you, bro. Sorry, Fab. Maybe next time, but probably not. Woo! It's just down to me and Ricky now. Got a little bit until the next challenge, so I'm just gonna do some stuff to occupy my mind. But at least there's only two of us now. One step closer to the ten thousand dollars. And while we wait for the next challenge, if you are not already subscribed to this channel, I do not know what you're doing. Click the subscribe button right now. I'll wait for you. Did you subscribe? Oh, you did? Okay, good, good. It is almost time for the next challenge. There's someone's cart right here though, so I'm kind of stuck if I want to get out. It is time for the next challenge. Honestly, I don't even want to read this one because they are starting to get hard. I barely made it past the last one. I have no idea what this is going to be, but act like the animal on the back of this card for 30 seconds in a busy aisle. Cow. I don't want to do this one, boys. And the animal on the back of this card is a snake in a busy aisle, too. Don't really have a choice here. We've been in this Walmart for literally the entire day. Sun's probably down right now. I just want to go home. This is going to be a hard one to watch. I'm going for it right here. Moo! 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 Dude, I can't even do this, bro. Honestly? You can do it. I can do it? Don't come on. Moo! 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 I'm sorry for that you guys even had to see that. I might have to go drink four of these just to get over seeing that. Golf club. All right, you guys are legends for real. Thank you. Oh, let's go. I don't know what animal Nick got. I hope that he did not make it past around because if he did, I don't even want to know what the next round is. I'm looking for a busy aisle and the more that I think about doing this, I'm like, yo, I do not want to actually do this. Act like a snake. I just don't want to do this, bro. And I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to go back to the employee only area and do these 30 seconds. Push me luck. I got my stopwatch. About to put 30 seconds on the clock. Here we go. I'm walking in. And they celebrated. Well, I got a singular fist bump. Everyone else just didn't do anything. They definitely had to have called somebody. I have found another employee only entrance and since the other employees didn't care, I feel like I'm just gonna put it to the test and walk in there real quick. It's like a warehouse back here. It doesn't look like anyone's in here though. If you guys ever wonder what it is like in the employee only entrance, this is what it's like. Bro, it's like no one in this Walmart cares what you do. I'm gonna last in here all night. I'm gonna do an overnight challenge up in here. I don't know if I caught it on camera, but an employee just walked by and he did this. Dude, no one in here cares. Are you allowed to go in here? Wait, anything? Whoa, let go! 
man. No, let no. Let go. No, no. Let go. No. Oh. Let go. No. Let go. Now, get rid of my name on there. All right, I'm, I'm deleting it right get now. Right now. Get ahead. Dude, he just took my shirt. But he took my shirt. That dude took my shirt. I'm running out here, bro. I'm going. I'm going. I'm going. The 30, the 40, the 50. I am out of here, bro. That dude attacked me. He grabbed me. He took my shirt. I'm out of this one more. Can you not get out this way? I can't get out this way. I gotta go through the main store. I don't know what to do. I'm literally in Walmart without a shirt because this dude ripped it off. I gotta get out of here, bro. I gotta go. Yo, I am going. I am gone out of there, buddy. That was insane. Literally, the moment I stopped recording, that dude attacked me because he knew that I was recording and he didn't want to do it on camera. Smart of him, but he grabbed my shirt and he wouldn't let go. He was literally on the ground. I took Ellen the challenge because I could not stay in there with that, bro. I literally don't have a shirt. Congratulations, Rex. You won the 10,000. Dude, the most crazy thing just happened. This dude attacked me, he grabbed my shirt. It was an employee. I literally had to run out of there since he, he ripped my shirt off and I just ran. Out no. Of a shirt, bro. Are you serious? Yes, bro. I win. Literally... So that means I win? Yes, bro, you won. I win. I win. Let's go. I knew I would be NCK and DJ Fab. It's too easy, bro. All the land over here is mine. No employee, no one can say or do anything. All I do is win and outlast everybody else. I really don't even care what anyone else says, bro, because at the end of the day, you just got to do you, and if you believe in yourself, you can win too. I couldn't have done it without all the support of everyone at this Walmart. I'm not even kidding. Everyone shopping here was so supportive, motivating me through it. Even the employees didn't care, and we walked away with the dub and the ten thousand dollars let's go they don't know me son they don't know me son do they know me son or they don't know me son they don't know me son who's gonna carry the boats yeah bro. Who, who's taking it out dj fab dj fab dj fab you know? And NCK. And NDCK. <laughs> and NCK. NCK. But, but mainly DJ Fab. But mainly DJ Fab. The employees here are absolutely lit. They all watch the vids. You watch the vids? Yeah. Let's go, bro. Legend. So you're not going to kick me out? Nah.